Welcome to CSC 171 online. This semester I will be your instructor. My name is Professor Anita Wright. Our course website is provided through Canvas. This is a strictly asynchronous course. There are no formal class meetings. My office is in the SIM building, but there will be no face-to-face -face office hours this summer. Instead, I will conduct online office hours on Wednesday mornings at 10 a.m. and Thursday evenings at 7 p.m. Again, these are not mandatory meetings. I will just be available for any questions or help that you need. Here are some preliminaries for the course. There are no formal prerequisites. However, an eagerness and determination to learn how to program a computer is really a great prerequisite. The textbook is an introduction to programming using Python by David Schneider. Here is a picture of the textbook. You will also need to purchase My Programming Lab subscription that comes with the textbook if you purchase it at the bookstore. If you buy this book used or online, be sure to go to Pearson's website and purchase a copy of My Programming Lab. For those of you who purchased this in, from the Camden County College Bookstore, you will find an envelope in the back of the textbook that contains your automatic registration code for My Programming Lab. You will also need to download and install the Python programming language with IDLE. You can do this by going to www.python.org slash downloads. Here is what the page looks like. If you are using Windows, you can click on Download Python 3.10.4. If you are using Mac or Linux, you can select the options for Mac or Linux. Most Mac computers have Python already installed, so check before you go ahead and download. Instructions for this are also located in Appendix C of your textbook. The current latest version is actually 3.10. The next thing you will need is My Programming Lab. This is what the web page looks like. If you are a first-time student accessing My Programming Lab, in other words, you have not used this for another course, after you get your registration code from the back of your textbook or by purchasing it through Pearson Online, you will click on the Student Register button to get started. However, if you have a subscription to My Programming Lab within the past year. For instance, you took a programming class in the fall or the spring that required the use of My Programming Lab. In that case, you should put in your account information and sign in. You will then be able to add another course. The subscriptions are good for one year. Here are a few tips for acing CSC 171, Introductory Programming with Python. Follow the plan. There are step-by-step -step instructions provided each week. These are designed to get you through the course in a productive fashion. Practice, practice, practice. The more you try things out, the more you will learn. Don't be afraid to make mistakes or to ask for some help. Focus on learning as much as you can and good grades will follow. And I'd like you to think of me as your coach. We are both on the same team and I will encourage you, sometimes drag you, other times push you to do your best work. Check in at Canvas. Although this is an asynchronous course and we don't have any formal meetings, I do add content fairly frequently when students ask questions or I notice a lot of you are stuck on a particular My Programming Lab. So look for announcements and 
notices put in the open or required discussion forums. Once you're set up, post to the Week 1 Introductions discussion forum and add some information about yourself. Then please reply to one or two other classmates. Although we are not meeting face to face, it's nice to get to know each other. After all, we are a community of Python learners. Happy Python coding! See you online!